Hello everyone, it's been a while. I hope you are all doing well and safe. A lot of you are requesting me to make a tutorial and, since I had no idea what specific tutorial I would make, I decided to do a drum fill lesson using the app. Today, I will share to you the step-by-step -step process on doing the fill that I formulated that you may apply to songs and grooves. In this video, I will use the default drum and sound preset of the app for the other users to be able to keep up or follow the lesson, and for those who have not yet familiarized themselves with using the app. Before we do that, let me share to you some few adjustments I made to come up with a more decent default overall drum sound. First, click the yellow drum kit icon on the upper left, then look for mixer and click it. Now, you can change the volume and pitch of the drum kit depending on your preference. I prefer to change the pitch of the kick to 1 and 2 for the snare to add a little bit of sound improvement and crisp. I lowered the volume of Crash 1, Crash 3, and the hi-hats to 95% because the 100% volume is too loud and in order to hear the kicks and snare better. Before we proceed, let me present to you the terminologies to serve as a guide for you to understand and follow the pattern that I will show you later. Feel free to do a screenshot to serve as your guide. Now, let's begin. The fill will sound like this. If this sounds difficult for you, don't worry. I'll pull this out into three parts. The first part will sound like this. This is for the second part. This is for the last part. Let's combine them. Now, let's apply it to the groove and guitar loop.
That's all folks. I hope you learned something today. Hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you want me to make more videos like this and leave a comment below if you have questions. Stay safe everyone, see you next time.